Jerry and Jerry Gilbert coming to you live from the tractor. The hurricane's coming is on its way. The hurricane is headed right for us. They got a hurricane coming. It's time to batten down the hatches, get the supplies together, do everything you need to get through the next four days. We got to make it through the next four days because the hurricanes are coming. But I got a question. I got a question for you. How come people that live on five soft drinks a day need to buy 81 cases of bottled water to make it through four days. Why they got to buy all the bottled water? You can't go to a store in this town and get bottled water. They all sold out bottled water and gasoline. What do you people put gasoline in? There are only so many gas tanks out here. You're filling up your gas tank, your, your, your gas can, your lawnmowers, your weed eating. I understand you need gas to put in your generator and keep your car full so that you can travel during the next four days. But golly, y'all done used up so many gas. What y'all doing? Putting it in pillowcases? How come ain't no gas stations got no more gas? Now, they got the expensive gas. They got super. But they don't have regular gas. They don't have the regular lead no more. They out of gas. So it's bottled water and gas. And another thing, I don't care if people been living the last year of their life on the keto diet, eating right, doing the right thing. The minute a hurricane coming, they got to clear out all the little Debbie snacks. They got all the little Debbie snacks bought up. You can't find a honey bun nowhere. Water, gasoline, and honey buns. Can't find a honey bun nowhere. Now, the hurricane is coming Saturday evening, but Friday night, everybody going to lock themselves in their house and eat all the hurricane snacks. By the time the hurricane comes Saturday morning, they're going to be out of snacks. No snacks for the hurricane. Everybody eat the hurricane snacks before the hurricane. Bottled water, gasoline, Little Debbie snacks, all gone. And this is what I don't understand the most. Now, I understand about the water. I understand about the gasoline. I even understand about the snacks. But the next one I don't understand is why when a hurricane is coming, we get on the prison diet. Water and bread. You can't find bread nowhere. Nowhere during a hurricane. I can find meat. I can find cheese. I can't, I can't find a sandwich nowhere. No bread, water, gasoline, or Little Debbie snacks. Now, y'all got to do hurricanes like I do it, like me and my people. A couple cases of water. Gas in all the generators and tanks. Little Debbie snacks, but I'm not worried about bread. As long as I got enough beer and liquor to make it four days, we good. Because if my roof is falling off my house, it's better when you're drunk. When you're drunk and your roof fly off, it goes a lot better. So remember this for hurricane survival. Beer and liquor will get you through. Y'all share this to all the hurricane survival getting ready for those people. And have a good time. Be safe out there. Peace out. See you later.